This week, we're going to be talking about two seemingly different ideas, procrastination and memory. But the two topics are intimately related. Why? Because building solid chunks in long-term memory, chunks that are easily accessible by your short-term memory, takes time. It's not the kind of thing you want to be putting off until the last minute. You already have one good tool for procrastination, the Pomodoro, that powerful 25-minute concentrated period of energized focus. This week, we're going to fill you in with more information about how procrastination happens and simple ways to tackle it. And this is key, ways that don't take much willpower. Then we'll move on to talking about some of the best ways to access your brain's most powerful long-term memory systems. I'm Barbara Oakley. Thanks for learning how to learn.